Hi, this is Dee with the Autoimmune Project, and I got mail. <laughs> it's Christmas here at my place. Um, every time supplements show up, this item is not, I repeat, not on the QSAC protocol. This is something additional that I chose to try out based on the recommendations of some of the other gals in the QSAC protocol Facebook group and thought I'd give it a try and see if it makes life even better. So what did I get? Well, let's see. What is this? What is it? Ooh, Bacopa Minari. Brahmi leaves. It improves memory hairs, as they put on here. And 949. Ordered it July 26th, received it August 10th out of India. That was the best price on organic powder. Ordered it via eBay. And came in this uh, shipping package. Looks like they do essential oils and things. <clears throat> it was wrapped in this several times, like a big old long strip of this. And it was rolled up in that a whole bunch of times. And then when I pulled it out, woohoo! The main bag. Serving size, half a teaspoon, which equals two grams. Can take up to four grams a day. Free of fillers, binders, artificial ingredients, dairy, soy, wheat, gluten, yeast. This is 100 grams that I purchased. So at 2 grams a day, that would last almost 2 months. So not bad, under 10 bucks for 2 months. Um, you can order from these same people bigger bags, but I wanted to go with the smallest one to make sure I can take it <laughs> and because um, I have mast cell activation disorder so allergic to the planet and everything on it and not just the planet allergic to the Sun too anywho so I thought I'd give give it a try first in the smallest quantity and if I do well I'll order a big sack anyway vegan ethically sourced that's important guys Make sure your stuff is ethically fair trade, etc. Okay? Make sure it's tested so you're not dealing with a bunch of heavy metals and craziness. Anywho, so I opened this sack, and this is a Ziploc type sack, and it was in here, and the smell is so good. It has a real earthy, herbally tea smell. It is, uh, it smells really good. It smells like a really good quality herbal tea, basically. Anyway, this is a foil package. And then it was wrapped in this Ziploc. So those are two Ziplocs. And then wrapped in another one. <laughs> They wanted to make sure this thing was not going to leak. So you go from this to this. So they double sacked it. Then they supplement sacked it. Foil sack. Then they bubble wrapped it. And this was around it like four or five times at least. <laughs> and then into the shipping thing. So they do a good job of making sure you're going to get your supplements undamaged and not leaking. And mine wasn't leaking at all. But boy, you could smell it the minute I opened up the foil pack this thing. 
I could smell it. And oh my gosh, it smells so good. But this is the color. It's kind of a medium brownish color, the powder. Um, so the serving size is half a teaspoon, but with mast cell activation disorder, we know not to do a full dose of anything. Sometimes you get away with it and sometimes you don't. And if you don't, it's not good. <laughs> you get really sick. So, <clears throat> and sometimes you, even those things that do make you really sick, if you start out with tiny doses and work your way up, you can get away with them. Kind of the same premise they use for allergy shots. They start you out on low amounts of what you're allergic to and work their way up until you develop um, the ability to not be allergic anymore. Anyway, um, so I think I'm going to start with half a gram. So that would be a sixteenth of a teaspoon. And we'll see how I do. Anyway, it's very fragrant. I think I'm going to try it just in warm water the first time and see what the flavor's like and see about maybe adding it to some of my Yogi organic teas or something of that nature. Now, it did come with these two spoons, too. These were down inside the brown sack, the sack. Two, um, I believe these are going to be a half teaspoon measuring spoons. Came with two of them. So, I got a couple of extras now. <laughs> Yay! Because I'm always measuring supplements and I'm doing it without scales right now. So, I've been using teeny tiny micro spoons and stuff for measuring. <clears throat> and with supplements, it's only really supplements that are teeny tiny fractions like niacinamide. Um, where you're using the really tiny micro spoons, can it be kind of tricky and making sure you don't get too much? But um, <clears throat> so far, I've been doing well without a scale. I do plan on getting one eventually, but the cost of the supplements, you know, I'm trying to keep costs down. And by the way, that's USDA organic too. Anyway, um, <clears throat> trying to keep the cost down so the scale is kind of a secondary thing and once I kind of have a handle on things and hopefully back to work knock on wood because um, I'm eight eight or nine months into this now and I'm just starting to uh, show some really good signs starting to show up Anyway, but I'll go on to that during a live stream. Um, and I do, yes, I know, I haven't been posting videos and I should be updating you all on what I've been doing. I think the last time I posted, I was trying L-Arginine and it threw me for a loop really bad twice in a row. <laughs> tried it once, gave up. Tried it again, gave up. Now I'm doing it again, but more on that in a live stream. But I just wanted to unpackage my newest selection for supplements to add to the QSAC protocol as just kind of an extra benefit. Not necessary. Keep that in mind. The protocol works. This is not necessary. It's just something I saw and it had so many listed benefits I had to try it. And found a good source for it. And went for it. So anyway, first bag of Bacopa. Mananari. Mananiri. Something like that. <laughs> Leaf powder. <laughs> Organic out of India. Anyway, I hope this finds you feeling better than I am. And talk to you. See you. And all that good stuff. Next time.